Baseball from the home of the Phil since 2004, Citizens Bank Park in Philadelphia. Opening day is here as we get the new season underway with a good matchup between the Atlanta Braves and the Philadelphia Phillies. Hi again, everybody. It's finally here. Welcome to our special opening day edition of Baseball on the Show. I'm joined by Dan Plezak. And Dan, as we get things going this season, it's pitching that has to be key if this team's going to have success. Hey, just like any team, pitching is going to be the key factor for this ball club as the year plays out. I'm sure the staff will have its ups and downs, but putting together some quality outings early in the season could do wonders for this club getting out of the gate with a good start. The game's count starting now. It's opening day. It's the show. And it's coming up next. Zach Wheeler gets the call to pitch here on opening day in front of the hometown crowd. Dan Plezak, what's the word on him? This guy had a real solid season last year. ERA under three on the year, which is pretty good in this day and age of high scoring and a lot of home runs. Let's see if he can duplicate that year and make break. this one just as good. It'll be interesting 13. to see how he pitches in this one today. He's ready. Here's the first pitch. Skied into straightaway right. Harper has a read on it. He's got it one away. Batting second, the shortstop, Dansby Swanson. And next will be Dansby Swanson digging in. His career line against Wheeler, he's got one hit in 17 at bats. He's also been a strikeout victim six times. Sinker to open the AB in there for strike one. The temperature here at game time still definitely on the cool side. 51 degrees at first pitch. Bases are empty, one man out. And it's fouled away. Here comes Wheeler's 0 2. Fouled away. The next 0 2. Swing and a miss on the fastball that time, out number two. So next up will be Freddie Freeman. The first first chance for him five. here in the top of the first with Freddie nobody on. Freeman. Infield in the overshift here, now the pitch. Oh, and here's a drive. Well hit out to straightaway center. A solo home run off the bat of Freddie Freeman. First home run of the campaign for him. As the Braves get on the board first, it's one to nothing. Well, after a long winter and a grueling spring, everyone is anxious to get the season started. But to start it off with a home run, there's no better way to get your campaign underway. He was rounding the bases thinking, hey, this is going to be a good year. That is good. Into the box now, Eddie Rosario. Line drive to center field. Hazley able to track it down for the third out. Braves able to. Digging in at the plate is Travis Jankowski. It'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. No left field. Yes, he'll take a look at ball one. Jankowski. 2 and 0. Hey, great job by the offense right here to put a number up on the board and allow this young gun to go out on the mound, relax a little bit, and establish that good fastball. 3 and 0 to him now. A 3 1 count to the Phillies' left fielder. Hey, that's a good sinker right there. 
That's his bread and butter pitch, and if he's got that going, especially early, it's going to be tough to get some runs off him. Three and two now. Now the payoff pitch home. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Rosario is there. One away. Now to the plate, Gene Segura. Here's the first pitch to him. The wind up and the 0 1. Hit hard back up the middle. That's a hit, their first of the new season. Nice execution right there, Dan. Kept his front shoulder in. Kept his hands inside the baseball, ripped the base hit up the middle. And if you're a pitcher right there, you can't get discouraged. Sometimes even when you make a good pitch, the ball is going to find a hole somewhere. That one right up the middle. Bryce Harper comes on with one away as he looks at a ball. It's 1-0. First shot for him here with a runner at first now and one away. 1-0 pitch. Can't come out of his game plan right here. He knows he's a known sinker baller. I know it was a four seamer right there, but get back to that two seam. It's what his MO is. Two and one to count. He's, he's going, ready now. Going, the pitch. Going. Runner goes for second. Strike taken to throw. He is right there for Darno to get his man. Well, so much for that first hit of the game. Tried to press their luck and move him up to second with the steal, but it didn't work out. Two and two count. Here it comes. Back up the middle and in for a base hit. Hard around first is Harper racing for second. And now he'll get into scoring position with two away. Batting four. The first baseman. Three. Hoskins. Next to bat will be Reese Hoskins. As the first pitch sinker misses to him, it's ball one. Runner in scoring position with two gone. And he turns this one around high and deep to center field. Acuna has to retreat to the track, but he has it to retire the side. Left for Philadelphia. They're down 1-0. New inning set to get underway. And stepping in the long ball threat, Adam Duvall. High in the air out to center field. Hazley is right there, and it's a very quick out number one. And stepping in, Austin Riley. First offering on its way. Taken high and deep to right. Harper looks up. And that one is gone. A solo shot here to straightaway right field. First home run of the campaign for him. And it's given Atlanta a two to nothing lead. Yeah, when he woke up this morning, the last thing he wanted was to be down 2 nothing in the second inning. The good news is that both home runs have only been solo shots, but the bad news is he's not fooling anyone right now. And that'll bring in the former top prospect, Ozzy Albies. And he puts it on the ground to second. Segura fields it cleanly, and he'll whip this one over to first, and he gets his man for the second out. Now it'll be Travis Darno. He'll work on keeping this top of the second alive. As he will look at a first pitch fastball for ball one. Fouled off. Change up just off the black and it's two and one. And he goes with the pitch here and drives it the other way to deep right. Back goes Harper, and he makes a nice catch on the track. Now at the plate, here is Brad Miller. So no runs, no base hits, no errors, and no one left on. Miller. 
in there no balls and a strike. Owing right. to the count to Miller. Got a pitch to the ballpark's dimensions right here. Love the execution of that pitch down in the zone. Got to keep the ball in the yard. To one and two now. Hit weakly back to the mound. And that's out He's number out. one. That exists. The Next catcher. up is JT Real Muto. Real Muto. Smoked on the ground up the middle. On to Freeman at first, and there are two away now. Got it, got it. Now to bat, Adam Hazley. Adam. Try to make something happen with two gone in the bottom of the second. First pitch coming, here it is. Swing and he pops him up. And this is going to be a foul ball. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. Grounder down the line at third. Bases are empty here with two men out. Into right field, that's a base hit. Boy, just when you're looking for one of those shutdown innings, you get two quick outs, D roll, then you have a two out base hit to extend the inning. Yeah, Ready. you show me a, a big league ball player Yo, that's going to give away an AB, no chance. Well, the side is retired as they make the play. Digging in will be Mike Soroka. He'll stand in to open things up here in the third. I'm interested to see how focused their ABs will be playing with this lead. I think this needs to be a little bit of a smell blood inning. Keep the fire rolling. I know it's early, but keep the pressure going. Swinging the bats nice. Here's a fastball that crowds him a bit, and it's one and one. And he fouls this one off. The one two. And a good bite to that slider as he swings through it for the first out of the inning. Good job of making him chase a pitch for the strikeout there. Yeah, Matt, that's the advantage of getting ahead in the count. You can really force hitters to expand their zone and protect. And when they're in that mode, getting them to go after a pitch they can't do much with becomes a lot easier. And here's Ronald Acuna Jr. now. Lifted in the air out towards left center. Long run for the center fielder and a great diving effort there but it'll just tip off his glove and it's a base hit. Hey that was a well executed pitch down and away. Sometimes you got to tip the your bat, hat to the offense. Seven. That's a nice piece Short of hit and maybe not what he was Dan looking B. for but the result was there. Dansby Swanson lining up to hit as he'll go after the first pitch and bounce it into foul territory. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. A 1 count. Here's the pitch. Down the right field line. Acuna is on his way home. He'll score easily as they push their lead to three now. Might have had the hit and run on right there because he was definitely moving on the pit. So he's able to cruise home all the way from first after the guy at the plate does his job and gets good one on a pitch for a double. Here's the first baseman, Freddie Freeman, as he'll look at a fastball too high for ball one. He launched one over the wall back in the opening frame. The 1 0. Hey, usually the second time through the order, you start seeing an incorporation of some more off speed stuff. But this guy's locating and feeling really good about his fastball. Two back to back. And it's fouled away. Mm -hmm. 
He pulls this one high and deep to right center field. But this is taken in on the warning track as the runner will tag from second. And he's up to third safely now with two gone in the inning. That was a nice job to track that one down in the alley because it definitely saved a run from scoring. Instead, he's only able to move up to third. Ready now is Eddie Rosario. Hit it hard but lined out in his first at bat. Yeah, he hit it hard. That's all you can ask. You can't control the results sometimes, Matty. Just unlucky with the placement. And he'll watch one miss up and away for a ball, 1 and 0. With the runner on third, two outs, base open, and a good hit at the plate, you have to be smart and not give in. If you walk this guy, so what? It's a lot worse if you give him a ball that he can hurt you on. 2 and 0 now. Swanson on third with two out. Mm, good downward movement fooled him there. Two and one. That is a pro pitch right there. 2 0 curveball for a strike. You make those kind of pitches, you'll be around for a long time. Hit hard on the ground towards second. And that's through into right field for a base hit. And that'll bring home another as they open it up to a 4 nothing advantage now. Now batting. Yeah, and when right a pitching field. coach goes to the mound and this early, he's probably just looking to reset the pitcher's mindset, get him to forget about the negative, and give him something positive to focus on. We'll see if he responds. Stepping in now, Adam Duvall. As the first pitch misses to him, it's ball one. Flew out in his only at bat so far. Here comes the 1 0. Now a swing and a weak little line drive over to first. A leaping try, but it's out of his reach and into the outfield. So now they'll have runners on the corners with two away. Well, that's what's so disappointing as a pitcher, d -Row. You make a really good pitch, and yet this guy's so big and so strong, he's able to muscle it into right field for a base hit. Yeah, you hand your batting gloves to the first base coach right there, and you thank your lucky stars. That's a nice A.B. At the plate now, Austin Riley. As the first pitch to him is in there for a called strike one. And we'll see what he can do here. Two on, two away, two home so far this inning. Oh, one pitch. Pitch is way outside and he can't even get a glove on it. Runners will stay put. However, the count evens at one. Now the one and one pitch. Line to the right side. Base hit and that'll get a run in. The batter number one. Second base. Here's the Philadelphia manager on his way out to the mound now. And that is going to be all for Zach Wheeler. So he'll exit here this afternoon to a smattering of booze after what can be described as really a subpar performance. Connor Brogdon please. is going to come on to pitch now, here, and in just the third it. inning, you have to think he'll Number be asked 75. to eat some innings. So up steps Ozzie Albies. He's got a chance to add on to what's already been a big inning for them. Yeah, two on here and three on the board already. They've absolutely come out and forced the issue of this inning. Matt, a hit here could really fire up that dugout. First pitch on its way. Oh, and he hammers it to deep right field. Harper looks up, and this ball is gone. No chance to make a play on that one. So it's a three-run shot to straightaway right field. First home run of the campaign for him as they've widened this lead to eight now. 
man that's not very nice you come in from the bullpen and you get greeted with a bomb he's going to have to hit the reset button pronto now better. The here's the catcher Travis, Travis. Darno. yes he pops the first pitch foul behind the plate 0 for 1 here in the early going. Set with the 0 and 1. Two out, nobody on. And he goes up the ladder on him, but he lays off one and two. He wasn't even close to swinging right there. That was a stone cold take. Fouled away. The next one two pitch and this is swung on and missed might have even been a foul tip that's held on to but either way the side is retired but it'll come at a cost as six cross the plate three of them on this three run home run bottom of the third first pitch of the A.B. on its way for the Phillies as he tries to go out and get the slider but it's not there it's strike one hey with this big a lead. You have to just pound the zone and force this team to get aggressive in the box. Ground ball sent back up the middle and that is through into center a base hit and the opposing pitcher gets aboard to kick off the inning. Well that's his first major league hit. There might not be too many more to come considering he's a pitcher but I'm sure that's still a pretty exciting moment for him. Hey listen hits are hard to come by Matt. I only had one in my entire 18 year career one for 15 but hey I still remember that one hit. At the plate Travis Jankowski as the sinker to him finds the zone for strike one. It was a fly out for him to start the home first. A ball nope. and a strike to the Phillies leadoff man. Brockton aboard here at first with nobody out. There's a fastball well off the plate for a ball. Lifted down the line and left. But this is just going to wind up being a foul ball. Liner towards second, but this is hauled in by the second baseman. Next, it'll be Gene Segura. He singled first time up. From the stretch. Runners on first with one down. Hit the other way out toward right field. Duvall is there to put it away and the runner will be forced to retreat back to first. Now Don't in the like box Bryce three. Harper. Right. Harper. First pitch coming here it is. Man he just missed the zone right there one of the toughest pitches in the game that backdoor cutter as an offensive player. Now here's a fly ball well hit. Racing back the right fielder on the warning track he makes the catch Philly strand start of the fourth upcoming but first Heidi Watney is standing by with a report Matt I had a chance to discuss the Braves offense with their manager Brian Snicker during the commercial break and overall he's really happy with the at bats they're putting together he said their ability to get on the attack and chase the opposing starter from the game prior to the fourth inning obviously sets them up nicely for the rest of the game. Now he just hopes they can keep that same focus at the plate in the middle and late frames Matt. OK thank you Heidi. All set for the start of the inning and next will be the pitcher Mike Soroka. First pitch of the A.B. now. And he misses inside with that one ball one. Fouled off.
Ready with the 1 1 pitch. Swing and a liner. And the pitcher's got himself a base hit. Hey, this is perfect storm right here. This is how big innings start. You put a crooked number up on the board when the pitcher leads off an inning with a huge knock. Acuna digs in now as he looks at a fastball that misses off the plate for ball one. One for two in the ball game thus far. Now the 1 0. Fly ball out toward left center field. Center fielder on the run. And he tracks it down. Nice play for the first out. The next to bat for Atlanta, Dansby Swanson, hoping to build off that RBI double from his last plate appearance. Yeah, give me a repeat performance of that last double. With a man on first right now, let him run, get you a ribby. Popped up. Hoskins is there. And that's the second out of the inning. Late now is Freddie Freeman flew out last time up. Almost, Maddie. Almost went deep his last AB. Certainly just missed it. With this guy's big power, he's feeling pretty good at the dish. Look for him to try and get on some. There's a swing and a drive, and everybody's just going to sit back and watch that one fly. A no doubt home run. A two run blast off the bat of Freddie Freeman his second home run of the game as this lead got even wider. And he was already off to a great start with a home run on opening day but then he goes and hits another one. Everyone knows he was putting in great work in spring training and it looks like that hard work has paid off. What a way to get your season started. The left fielder, number eight, Eddie. Standing in now, Eddie Rosario. Rosario. As the first pitch to him is off the plate for a ball, one and oh. A hit in two at bats for him at this point in the ballgame. The 1 0. -oh. Lifted in the air to center field. And no trouble for him as he makes the catch to end the inning. But two in the inning for Atlanta, both coming on this two-run home run. Bottom of the fourth coming up. It's the Braves 10 and the Phillies nothing. And that'll bring up the Sacramento product, Reese Hoskins. Comes into this at-bat 0 for 1 in the ballgame. Strike one to start the at-bat. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. This guy's been really on point so far, but it's not getting any easier. He has to get through four, five, and six right here. Tried to get him to go after the slider, but it's one and two. Did a good job to shorten up and protect the plate, and he'll have another shot at it here. Again, a one-two. Boy, good cutting action to that pitch as that's the first out of the inning. This guy is really locked in on the bump right now. He's just playing good old-fashioned hardball Number right now. Basement. Just Number rearing 13. back and letting it go. And it seems Brad. like this lineup, they don't have an answer Miller. for anything he's bringing so far. So now to the plate, Brad Miller. As the first pitch to him oh, is swung on and missed for strike one. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. Here's the 0 1. No runs, four hits, and no errors on the ledger for the Phillies to this point. Not surprisingly, here, this is on the ground to the right side. And that's the second out. Now, 
Two are gone in the Philly fourth. And in steps the catcher, JT Real Muto. Now the pitch. As he'll go after the first pitch to him and comes up empty, it's strike one. Man, this guy's been incredibly efficient so far in this one, mostly because he's getting ahead. 70% of the batters he's faced, he's thrown a first pitch strike to. And another foul ball. The 0 2 once more. Is a swing and a miss. That's strike three. Three up, three down for Philadelphia. Starting to look bleak. Down 10 nothing. Sam Coonrod gets the call to pitch here, and he'll try to sort this mess out. He's going to try to at least eat a couple of innings for his guys. First pitch of the A.B. on its way. And a check swing. Did he go around? No, says the first base umpire. It's ball one. Now the 1-0. -oh. Left center, base hit. Hey, guys, this, he's not known for being a singles hitter right here, but that's now his second it. knock Third of the base. game. And I'm sure he'll take him, but the guys on the other side of the scorecard might be thinking we really avoided a worse fate. Stepping in once again is Austin Riley, singled home a run in his last time up. First pitch on its way. High and deep to left. This one's got plenty of distance. And out of here, and I mean by plenty, that ball was crushed. It's a two-run shot to straightaway left, his second of the game, as they just continue to pour it on here. Who says hitting isn't contagious? These guys have been feeding off each other all game, and five home runs as the result. I'll tell you, you might see some scuffles in the on-deck circle between guys fighting to get to the plate. Into the box, Ozzy Albies. Yes, he pops the first pitch foul behind the plate. And he fouls this one off. No outs, nobody on. Swing and a drive to right center. Hey, that ball's going to be way out of here. Back to back home runs. Ozzie Albies with a solo homer. His second home run of the game as the blowout continues. Another excellent swing right there. That's multiple home runs in the same inning. Watch yourself. You're missing over the heart of the plate. Archie Bradley gets the call to pitch here, and he'll try to sort this mess out. He's going to try to at least eat a couple of innings for his guys. Into the box now, Travis Darno. As he'll watch one miss down and in for a ball, 1-0. No hits to this point. Down the left field line and deep. And this will wind up a foul ball. Bradley is one of those guys that just seems to be at his best under pressure. Runners in scoring position, tight game, tough hitters at the plate. That's when he's at his best. One of the keys, Matty V, to being a good reliever is being able to pitch out of trouble. Trouble that's created by the pitchers before you, or sometimes you even have some mess that you put on yourself. Hey, regardless if it's a mess that he's inherited or one that he's created for himself, this guy makes good the pitches pitch when the four. game's on the line. And now in the box, Mike Soroka. He's working on a one for two game so far. He'll roll over it and send it to shortstop. Reined in. 
And there's out number two. Now with the plate is Ronald Acuna. It was a fly out for him in his last trip. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Here's a huge swing by Acuna and a drive to deep left. And it's gone as they add still another. A solo shot here to left. First home run of the campaign for him as this lead got even wider. Well, when a manager talks about hitting being contagious, that is exactly what we're talking about. One guy tees off, and the guy behind him starts to feel a little bit more confident, a little bit more focused. The next thing you know, you've got three home runs in an inning, and your entire offense is off and running. To the plate now, Dansby Swanson. Dansby Swanson. He's got a hit in three at-bats to this point. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. Now a flare out toward right center. Segura has a play. He handles it easily, and the inning is over. So four runs in the inning, but of note there was that they came on the strength of three home runs. Last half of the fifth coming up, the Braves lead it 14 to nothing.